Okay, hello everyone, how are we doing? Welcome back to the channel. We're cheating again. Oh yes, last Friday I cheated on GeoGuessr using Google, uh, trying to get it. Well, I did get a perfect score on the world version. Of course I did, I was cheating. How long did it take? About 35 minutes, just over 35 minutes. It wasn't a time that I wanted to make official. I, I sped little bits up. This week, however, I'm aiming to get a time that is lower than that and lower than my record of 30 minutes and 5 seconds without cheating. I'm going to need slightly more favourable rounds and if we get them, I'm confident we can do it. And hopefully we won't have to speed a single thing up. That is the aim today. My methods were slightly iffy in the first one. There are just some things that you just don't, I just don't think to do. I don't think to do them like a Google Translate, putting the man down on Google Maps to see if it looks the same, even telephone numbers. So yeah, you've got to think outside the box. But as I said in the comments, my knowledge of the dark side is growing and hopefully I can remember to do all of these things, if not today, in a couple of weeks time. Let's do it. Okay, guys, here we go. We're doing it again. And this looks interesting. Look at that car. Very interesting color and model of car combination. Um, right, we need to get up onto this main road, I would have thought. Um, well, we would ordinarily. It's not an ordinary game though, is it? What is this? I can't see what that is. Can we, can we? No, it's just apartment buildings, isn't it? I do want to get up here onto this road. That's what I set out to do, and that's what I'm gonna do. So if we can just get over here. Can we jump up? I bet we can't, can we? No, of course we can't. All right, back we go. This shit happens sometimes on GeoGuessr. You don't get your way. You just don't get your way. So, right, we're in Finland. A Nolan, A Nolan Ranta. A Nolan Sisters Ranta. There, that's how I remembered that. And there it is, neighborhood in Finland, in that place there. Maps. We are against the clock here, so. Um, right, there's our bridge. A hey, Nolan Ranta. How long does that go on for? That doesn't make much sense to me. Because if we go back. A hey, Nolan Ranta. Huh. We are on the south side. Yes, that is correct. Uh, how far are we from this bridge? I've got to. I've got to find it. I've got to find it on uh, GeoGuessr first. Whereabouts is that again? It's right in the middle, isn't it? Northeast of Tampere. Got to get this. Th there's a lot of this to in and fro in from certain maps. So the quicker you can be, the more. The, well, the quicker your time will be, I guess. Um, but it does look quite frantic, doesn't it? So there's the bridge then. That is definitely it, isn't it? Yeah, because we've got all this wetland here. So surely we're on the bend. We're we're on the bend and we're on the mend. Hang on, let's just get this right. That is the idea to get it right. Ah, oh, shit. That one's there. That one's there. So does that put us there? No, it can't do because I'm going to go there in the middle. There you go. We were actually over there, apparently. 33.9 uh, meters. Excellent stuff. We are against the clock, so we'll soldier on. But that's a good start. I don't know if that was quicker than last week's first round, but a good start nonetheless. And look at this now. Bjorki Dalen. Bjorki Dalen. That's another easy one to remember. The singer Bjork E. Dalen. That's multiple female singers. Bjork and the Nolan sisters like any of you have heard of them. But there we go. There's the lake. We found it straight away. Bjorki Darlin. Wonderful. Again, we are on the, well, we're on the west side this time, on this road of this lake. Can't see the entrance to the village of Bjorki Darlin, but we're going to have to, we'll just have to work it out in different ways. So does that little road, can we see that little side road there? 
How far to the end of the lake are we? Quite far. I'd say we're near the top of the lake. Up here somewhere. Huh. Yeah. I'd say we're up here somewhere. Um. How about that little junction there? Could that be it? No, I don't think that is it. Let's keep going. Keep going. Let's not jump at any rash conclusions. <coughs> Lots of these little rivers dotted about. Wow, look at the grass on that roof. Little aquatic hobbit house. But yeah, we're hugging the lake now tightly. We're coming around the fattest part of the lake. And then, yeah, it's more of the same. So I'm going to go back to the start, guys. And it's frozen. Okay, there we go. Um, I believe that we were hugging the lake there. We hugged the lake where we started as well. So that would put us about here, I would have thought. Obviously, we need to find it on the on GeoGuessr. Yeah, yeah, that's, that's where we are. And there's a bus stop there as well, I believe. So, need to find this then. Bjorkedal, it's a lake. So, be easy to spot, potentially. Hmm, okay. Well, it's in line with the with Norway, but north of Bergen, that might not be on the other map. Nordfjord, north of Bergen, Nordfjord, just as it starts to pull over to the right. There's Bergen, there's Nordfjord, there's the lake, got it. It's worth spending that bit of time just to cement it in your head, really, otherwise you'll just end up going to and fro, to and fro, which is annoying. I believe that puts us... I'm just going to have a little quick look down here. I don't want to bugger this up. Oh, it goes into a tunnel there. Right. That's interesting. Well, that's not on the map. But I'm just going to go there. Cool. Yeah, couldn't have been too far, could it? Right, next one. Is this Europe again? I don't know. But if it is, then that is incredibly jammy. Because I was expecting more of Brazil, more of Japan. What have we actually got? Oh, God. You spoke too soon, sport, didn't you? Serves me right, doesn't it? Of course it would be Japan after saying that. Um, yeah, I think it might actually be, you know. God, it's God. I'm desperate for any sort of uh, English names, Latin alphabet, whatever you want to call it. Okay, what have we got? Oh, it does. It, it does have something there here we go look okay well for a start I think this is Korea look on the side of there there's uh, the circular symbols Korean Kao K-A-W I don't think I'm going to get that right if I type that in on Google Ko Kao Lin Ko Lin Wogan I'll try it I'll try what I think I can see Call Lynn Wogan <laughs> is what I've arrived at. Sounds like the note you'd get returning to work on Monday. <laughs> Call Lynn Wogan. I mean, that ain't right, is it? No. No. Okay. Uh, right. I think we need to keep going. I mean, that could be completely wrong. Can we see the other side of it? Can we read it? No, that's blurred out. Right. Okay, um, what do we do? Because I just can't read that. Just can't read it. Um, I think I've just got to have another snoot around here. And look for more signs that might be in English. But that is promising. It'll be extremely annoying if we end up not being able to do anything about that. What about this sign coming up now? Any English? Come on, what have we got this time? Which hilarious name is it going to be? God, there is English, look. But it, it again, it's not... You can't read it. You just can't read it. Up Canopy. I'm going to type that in. Screw it. Up. Up Canopy, South Korea. Hmm. 
Hmm. God. <laughs> Do Koreans have hookup sex? Um, up canopy. Are we definitely in Korea? I'm starting to think not now. We had circles on the van, but I'm starting to think not based on this now. So this is interesting. Maybe that font w threw me off or something. But okay, are we driving on the left or on the right? I'm so sorry. I can't think of everything at once. We're driving on the left, so it's Japan. I'm so sorry. Okay. <laughs> oh, God. I just can't think of everything at once. It's as simple as that. Right. Here we go. That is my job, I guess. Right. Up can it be? Yeah. Right. I wonder if I can go back now and maybe try and Google that other thing. Pension. Up can it be? Okay. Well, I can get rid of. South Korea and put Japan up Canopy Ski Resort. All right, then. Let's have a look at that. Camping field. We need the camping fields, don't we? Now, can we find them? Um, so, camping fields. Now, why would it do that when I'm already here? Usually just searches for things around there doesn't it so camping take away the field what happens right that's better Kana bekego go again camping ground i'm going to go back i'm going to try and find a, a road name guys because we know roughly where we are we just need to hmm which road which way do i go Is that a four? I don't know what that is. I'm going to keep going. This may take a little while, but we'll we'll get there. We will get there. Soccer, sports. Okay. Yeah. If we can get to a main road here. Get the number. Ooh. Look at that. Do we search that? Rather tempting, isn't it? A phone number. Should we do it? <coughs> okay, I'm going to open another tab. 07. Start of my number, that is. 9645-0707. Right, there it is. Um, now what do we do? Translate, I guess. Welcome to Canopy. Right, yeah. Can we maps that? No. Redditch. Wait, that's not my Redditch. That's somewhere else. Haven't got time. Um, so, translate again. Let's have a look. Let's have a look. Yeah, come in. Where is that then? Guest house. There it is. So, okay. Mia Moso. I don't think we want that. That's just like a yellow pages. Unless there's a map. Is there a map? Uh, yeah, there is. We're getting there, guys. <laughs> it's a long one. It's always going to be a long one in Japan, isn't it? So, that's where it is. We've come from... We've come from the north. It does kind of correlate. Look, I think we've come from down here. And then we've come up here. Um, yeah, we've we've... Okay, where is this then? Let's zoom out. Can we correlate that to this? I don't know if we can. Um, right? Can we translate? Can can we translate everything? No. Okay. Okay. Keep zooming out then. <coughs> right. Yeah. I totally see it now. So actually, that might have been the right campsite there. Okay, going to get on my third map now, the GeoGuessr map. I think we finally got it. If I can zoom out of this. Where is that? Okay. So it is north of Himeji in a completely straight line. Near Yabu. 
Let's get in there. Himeji, Yabu, up here, and Canopy Ski Resort. Right, back to the start we go. Um, that phone number just confirmed where we were, didn't it? And there's the bend, which I believe... Where are we? Where are we? I've lost it. Is it there? I believe we're here, basically. Canabagokan camping ground. Now, we want to get this right. We want to turn around. See how far it is this way. Got some lovely... What is that? It's a rugby field. I f yeah, of course, they play rugby. They're hosting the Rugby World Cup, for God's sake. And did you see that sign back there? I hope that wasn't a good one. Um, okay. That looks like one of the guest houses. I think we're about halfway down this. And I think I can pretty safely go... There, I guess. I mean, yeah. Phew. Wow, yeah. That was just a pure. That was just me going. Well, we're halfway down, so surely I can't be too wrong. Two rounds to go, guys, and this is either going to be terrible or not so bad. I've got a feeling it might be terrible, but let's see what this sign says. Donna Buang Rainforest Gallery. Okay, well that's going straight into Google. Donna, was it Donna like that? Donna Summer. Everyone's had a singer. Donna Buang Rainforest Gallery and Skywalk. How far is that then? Is that up here? If it is, then we're laughing. Maps, please. Don't take me to Redditch. No, hasn't taken me to Redditch. What country is this? I'm guessing it's Australia. Yeah, not far from Melbourne. So, Rainforest Gallery. Oh, we just have to work out where we are now. Let's get back into GeoGuess. I'm actually going to, while it's fresh in the mind, get back in. Melbourne. Um, can I see it from here? Can I see it? Is that too... <coughs> that's too um, optimistic, isn't it? So, it is... Okay, yeah. Right, I think I can get that. There. Just memorise the shape of these roads. Okay. I'm going to go up here then. <coughs> See how far we actually are from this thing. God, this is actually a fully fledged road. Warburton. Okay, we've got a junction. So, what's this junction saying? It's saying Rainforest Gallery. Um, what's down there? Mount Donna Buang. And that's north. And also Healesville. But that's too far to acknowledge. Too much. Rainforest Gallery. Just there, apparently. I think that's the actual thing, isn't it? And, uh, oh, Alexandra 62. Warburton. That way. C507 for both, you can only presume. Right. There, C507. That's the junction we're at. Look, they almost match up there. There's the Rainforest Gallery. So we need to count the bends, guys. And that, that image there, um, frightening at the time, but turns out not so bad. I told you it would either be awful or good, wouldn't it? I just had a feeling. Right. So we've done a little S bend, basically. We've gone, uh, 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 and I would say we're about there. I mean, yeah, I've, I've got to double check. I really have. That one bends left. That one bends right. I'm going there. Oh, <laughs> it's always scary when you see like three figures there in a big line, but we've done it. Last one. Come on, come on, come on. Let it be a good one. Oh, God, please don't say it's Russia. It's going to be Russia, isn't it? I have no idea what time we're on. Um, God almighty. Okay, let's hope it's not too Russia-y. 
whatever that means. Um, I'm just, yeah, it's, there's no way this ain't a Cyrillic writing place, is it? No way, Jose. Okay, well, maybe we can implement for the first time the technique of um, Russian alphabet letters. Uh, here we go. Yeah, okay, so O-P-W-I-B. Right, here we go. I've had a look. Russian alphabet. There's a Wikipedia play page. Look, I checked this out uh, earlier. And here we go. Got a little notepad here ready just in case. I'm going to get rid of that because I'm a nightmare with tabs. O-P-W-I. Okay, well, I need Google, actually. O-P-W-I. I wonder if this will... I wonder whether it will recognize those. I don't know. And then we need B. B is also a Latin letter. Well done, mate. Um, and then we need that. What is that? These are in order of rarity. So there it is. I thought it would be quite a low down one. Only 0.39%. That would be worth at least 16 in Scrabble. Russian Scrabble. Oh, there must be a Russian Scrabble. I'll have to Google that afterwards. Um, well, I'm all over the place. And I. So, no, that didn't work. Right, so I need to copy and paste all of these guys, unfortunately. So, this is what the notepad was for. This shouldn't take me too long. I'll probably speed this up. Actually, no, I won't. This is a new experience. This is good. Wait, is that a big P or because there's there's big P's and small P's, or maybe there isn't. I don't know. That, yeah. Uh, P W. Is that even a W? I don't think it is. I think that was part of the problem. I think that was the main culprit, really. So, whatever that is. I. Where's I? How can I be that rare? Where is it? It's not on there, guys. That's... That's insane. Where is I? This is crazy. I don't want any of them. I need I. I there. So, okay, I'm guessing that is just an I, you know, but still. Um, I don't know why it wasn't on that thing. B, there, fairly common. B, I, c I could just, yeah, I don't know. I don't know if there's a quicker way to do this. I really don't. That one. We're getting there though. And the last one is another I, so I can just take that over. And no, I don't want to control V, control C. Not in this scenario. I'm not a master of the keyboard. Right, this has to work. Get in. It's worked, I think. Right, maps. Right. Or shiv or shivd C. That's where we are. Is there a train station? Because it looked like there was a train station there. That's slightly worrying if there isn't. Is that a train station? Maybe it's an old one. Uh, but that road does correlate with that. So, yeah, I mean... Oh, it's in Ukraine. Wow, okay. Um, the good news is there aren't any other options that pop up on the map. So, where is that? It is... Okay, it's north west of Chur yeah, that. I can't I can't do it. I can't multitask guys, you're just gonna have to guess what I'm thinking all the time. Chernivts and then <coughs> Okay, yeah, clearly didn't study that enough. That's what happens when you don't. Where where's that gone? Okay. There and then it's by Nepolo and you guess the rest. So, Nepolo, well, where's that one then? My God, am I going blind? Who would have thought this would be the hard part, comparing two maps together? I am going absolutely stark raving mad, clearly. 
Where is this elusive shithole? The Prout River. Just follow the Prout River, mate. Simple. Prout River. There it is. I don't know what I was doing there. Right, back we go. To the start. I better get this right. I better get this right. Does the road bend? Follow it. Follow it. Are we below 30 minutes? I think we're very close. So this is awful. It's so anxiety inducing. Almost as much as the World Cup cricket final was on Sunday. That almost gave me a heart attack and I don't even watch cricket. Okay, that is, that is <laughs> as straight as a die. Back to the start this way. Yeah. Oh, this is also excruciatingly straight as well. When's it going to bend? When's it going to end? When's it going to bend? It bends there. Oh, man. Right. Okay. I presume that that is that bend there. Rich products shop. Can we see that? I need to make sure this is the right brand, uh, bend. Maybe that says rich products shop. I don't understand why they're all in English on the map. And then, uh, God, that is a weird shop if it is one at all. Right, well, okay, back we go, I think. Let's see what we've got here. Is there an X station or anything? Right. Good gravy. Okay. Ah, Stadion. Oh, man. I don't, I don't know what to look out for here. What about this little road here? Okay, maybe we can use this. What does that do? It goes down and then it bends to the right. That could be that. But it also could not be very easily. There's apparently a supermarket there as well. So that's not promising. I think we need to be further south a bit. Could be there. Yeah, because that could be the restaurant. This one here. Let me just show you. That. Is that a restaurant? I would say it is. Should we go by that? I'm going by that. Oh, thank God. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, Okay, was that recording? Uh, yes, it was. Well, that's that. View summary. What time did we do it in? I can confirm that we did it in 28 minutes, 25 seconds. We've done it. We've done a sub-30 game. Well, it's not that big an achievement, really, is it? I did cheat, after all. But that's what I was trying to do. I was keen to beat my record uh, without cheating, and I've done it. Well done, mate. There was even a Japan and a Russia round thrown in there. Um, so on to, you know, sub 20, sub 15, maybe even sub 10. Do you guys want to see that? Let me know. I think it's really fun. It's a different way of playing. But as I said last week, it's, it's fun. Just very different. Right, Sunday. What are you doing on Sunday? No, you're not. You're tuning in at 8pm to watch the Mission Across Wales, episode 1. That's what you're bloody well doing. I'm so, so excited to release this thing finally after so much hard work, blood, sweat and tears, literally. Um, and I'm so excited for you all to see it. It's going to be amazing. In the meantime, have a great weekend and I'll see you all on Sunday. It's going to be epic.